Hello. My name is Michael Stipe. I worked alongside Josh Fox, the fracking guy, on his first feature film, which was about veterans returning from war during the Bush years. I grew up as an army brat and as the only son of a three-time combat veteran, I know firsthand the costs of war on the brave women and men who come back home from duty and try to integrate themselves into society and return their lives to some semblance of normalcy. I want a candidate who understands that as well. I want a candidate who said no to the Iraq war and said no to the disastrous Patriot Act. That candidate is Bernie Sanders. Bernie Sanders has spoken very clearly about veterans and their needs. He has addressed other issues that are important to me, such as LGBTQ rights, the environment, climate change, privacy rights, racial equality, and economic justice. His positions on these issues are consistent, common sense, compassionate, and clear. We are at the dawn of a different type of 21st century. Our actions as voters and citizens will form who we are to become, not only to ourselves and the next generation, but to all Americans. We have the profound capacity to be the great country that we imagine. But to do that, we need a caring, tough, and straight-talking leader. You know, authenticity and honesty are not qualities that we often assign to politicians in Washington, D.C. In fact, they are apparently very rare qualities. But in Bernie Sanders, we find someone who has spoken clearly and directly and has kept himself on the right side of history at virtually every turn since he's been in the public eye. He is trustworthy, and he not only deserves our trust, he deserves our vote. There's a revolution at hand. My goddaughter is here tonight, 18 years old, excited to vote for her very first time in the primary her very first time ever in the primary on April 19th, and then in the election come November. She's thrilled to join all of us here in voting Bernie Sanders into office. This is just the beginning, but this is a pivotal moment for us all. In order for the people to be heard, the people have to speak up. This is our moment. It will take every one of us standing together on April 19th and beyond to make this happen. I really want, and I think you really want, for this change to come with the leadership of Bernie Sanders. It is my honor and privilege to introduce the next President of the United States, Bernie Sanders!